pass SQL exam 70-461. And job interview, programming SQL Server 2012. This is Kalmantov. This is my new book. It is 820 pages. It will prepare you for the Microsoft certification exam, also for job interview, and generally for a successful career as a database developer. You can order it at this order link or on Amazon search for the ISBN number or you can just enter the exam number or you can just enter my name. Let's see how we can transfer a flat file which has text in it into a table. This is the table which uh, we are going to create. So ID is just a int identity surrogate primary key line. This is the destination where the text is going to come and this is just a timestamp. Let's create the table. and fire up the SSIS import export wizard tasks import data so this is a wizard the data source is a flat file we have to enter the file name this is the name of a text file and uh, there is no column name in the first data row. This is how it looks. Advanced. We have to change this to a higher number because lines are longer than 50 characters. Preview. Next. This is the destination and we have to find the destination table, import text, edit mappings, change this to destination line. This is our destination, OK. Preview. This is a sample text. Next. So far, so good. Next. So, from the flat file is going to transfer to the import text table. Finish. And 60 rows transferred. It was successful, otherwise, you would get an error message. Let's check it. So if we do a select, we can see that uh, the text has been transferred from the flat file. And if I sc scroll over to the right hand side, we can see that uh, the modified column contains the timestamp. So the text from the flat file arrived to the line column. The ID column is identity11. It has been uh, filled automatically by the identity function. And the modified date time 2 column was filled by sysdate time. This is the end of the short demo.